The Sixties. The Beatles. The Rolling Stones. Lulu. And Richie, Shearer and Caldo. Greg McKinnon and Baxter. Henderson, McMillan, Miller, Brand and Wilson. That was the Sixties. Well, he was one of these fantastic young schoolboy players, came to the attention of a lot of people, and in 1960, Rangers signed him on an S form, but he couldn't sign his professional forms until his 17th birthday, which he duly did in 1961. Willie Henderson made his debut for Rangers as a 16-year-old, displacing Alex Scott, who was a bit of a Rangers icon. Rangers sold Alex Scott to Everton in the knowledge that this teenage prodigy ready to step into the first team, um, and it all fell into place. Willie Henderson was a winger, or an outside right, as they were termed at that time, when he broke through into the Rangers first team. He was a dribbler, and he had an exceptional turn of pace, and he was a very good crosser of the ball as well. Willie Henderson was a good old traditional winger. He was quick, he was direct, he was skillful. He could beat fullbacks, he could cross a ball, he could create for other players, and he could score goals. He was everything that you would want a winger to be. If you read back some of the newspaper articles, he was probably the best winger in Europe, in some respect, in the early 60s. 